Hello guys and welcome, Cat here. With the upcoming release of Dark Souls 2, I figured it would be a cool idea to go back and take a look at some of the bosses from Dark Souls 1, and just basically offer whatever little insight I may have into killing these bosses as simply as possible. Nothing too advanced, just simple advice from one gamer to another. Alright, so first up is the Asylum Demon. Um, all you have to do is get the plunge attack on him right there because that will give you a nice little advantage. Um, pretty easy boss. I figured I'd include him anyway because, I don't know, some people might struggle. Um, stay away from his front side because he does sweep attacks and overhead attacks. Um, uh, do be wary though that some of these sweep attacks can nail you even though you're to the side of him, like I just demonstrated right there. Um, but yeah, just roll and strafe and do whatever you have to do to try to stick to his rear side because that's where you want to be. The only thing you have to watch out for from behind is this butt slam attack that he does which is very annoying and knocks you down. The rest is easily avoided. But the butt slam is too. <laughs> Alright, so the only thing you want to watch out for also is the various jars in the room because you get caught if you get caught in them that will be annoying and you know he will nail you unnecessarily. But alright, he went down there so obviously it's a simple boss but I included him just for the hell of it. Alright, so we'll be getting out of the asylum now and... I'll be seeing you in the next video for the next boss. But uh, if you enjoyed this, please make sure to let me know by liking and commenting and all that stuff. But for now, thank you and bye!